Harry humiliated as Ryan Reynolds refused to take a photo with him at Los Angeles bar. Prince Harry made a surprise appearance on Instagram Monday after Rob McElhinney posted a photo of himself and his It's Always Sunny in Philadelphia co-star, Glenn Howerton, hanging out with Harry. In the photo, Harry sports a black shirt and matching blazer while taking the picture with McElhinney and Howerton. The photo was taken when the trio attended the soccer match between Inter Miami CF and Los Angeles at FC BMO Stadium in LA in September. Aside from that slight allergic reaction to the nuts, 2023 was one of the best years of my life, McElhinney captioned a carousel of photos, which also included Charlie Day and wife Caitlin Olson. Thank you to the people and places that made it possible, the actor continued. My life is full of love and joy because of you. He concluded, so excited for 2024. I'll stay away from the nuts. The Duke of Sussex was not the only celebrity to be featured in McElhinney's slideshow. He also shared a throwback with Ryan Reynolds, who co-owns the Wrexham soccer team with him. But Ryan Reynolds refused to take a photo with Harry amid his tension with the Harkles over the Invictus Games. Many commenters joked about McElhinney's multiple run-ins with the royal family within the past year. That picture with Prince Harry's iconic, one user wrote in his Instagram. A second user asked, did you really try and fist bump the Queen? Markle's nowhere to be found, no wonder Harry's smiling. Picture is from September? Harry trying to look like he has mates in 2024, the fourth said. Another one added, Harry in a bar, he's never with the Invisikids looking for any reason to get away from them. It comes as according to experts said that as Prince Harry and Meghan Markle ring in the new year, they have work ahead to solidify the public image and career pursuits. Culture expert Nick Eid says 2024 will be a crossroads as the couple establishes themselves properly. He advises focusing on one element rather than being jacks of all trades. Meghan, the Duchess of Sussex, excelled at lifestyle topics in the past and Harry, the Duke of Sussex, through the Invictus Games. Eid suggests these remain their priorities rather than their endeavours in Hollywood's entertainment industry. Next year is an important year for them, and they'll need to establish themselves properly, he continued. They have to go back to basics. Meghan needs to concentrate on lifestyle, beauty, fashion and acting, and Harry on the Invictus Games and being a father figure and mentor to many. Harry and Meghan made efforts cracking Hollywood after relocating to America, but their big Netflix deal has produced just two projects so far. An earlier Spotify partnership also ended. A Spotify executive reportedly called the Sussexes grifters in a sign of challenges partnering with major corporations. Returning focus to proven strengths like the Invictus Games or Meghan's lifestyle projects could help curate the public image. 